So we celebrate this blessed event in the life of your family and all the community of faith. Jesus said, let the little children come under me. Do not hinder them. For such as these belong to the kingdom of God. In this sacrament, we get a living, breathing portrayal of the word grace. The fact that God loves us even before we are born. Numbers the very years on our head and holds us in His arms as we grow up in the knowledge of Him. So I'm going to ask you now, you and presenting Nicholas Garrison for holy baptism, you confess your faith in our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. You therefore accept as your bounden duty and privilege to live before Him a life that becomes the gospel, to exercise all godly care that He be brought up in the Christian faith, that He be taught the Holy Scriptures, that He learn to give reverent attendance upon the private and the public worship of God. Will you endeavor to keep Him under the ministry and guidance of the church until He, by the power of God, shall accept for Himself the gift of salvation and be confirmed as a full and responsible member of Christ's holy church. We have a special treat today because his big sister, Mowry, is going to help me in the baptism. So now I'm going to get down here so you can help. Ready? Okay, what name is to be given this child? Okay, put your hand on the back of his head, okay? Nicholas Garrison, I baptize you in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Pray God's riches, blessings upon you now and all the days of your life. Amen. Now the problem is I got down. Somebody gets that up. That will be the challenge. I want you all to see this beautiful young man here. What a privilege that it is for us to share this moment. What a wonderful family he has. What wonderful friends he has. What wonderful big sister he has. And he is just so blessed in many ways, but we are blessed to share this journey of life with him, to share this faith with him, and to watch and see what God is going to do with his life. What a privilege is ours to share this moment with you, with your loved ones. And in sharing this moment, we make a covenant with this family, so will you please join me? Brothers and sisters in Christ, we have witnessed this baptism. God requires that we be accountable for our part in the welcoming of this child into the household of faith. Therefore, I hereby commend him to your love and care. Join me, please. With God's help, we will sober our lives after the example of Christ that Nicholas Garrison will be surrounded by steadfast love, established in faith, and confirmed in the way that leads to eternal life. We say yes with all the household of faith that God has loved, and we are the living examples of that love. Amen. As we continue in our time of worship and as our ushers.